Hey foodies, I'm gonna show you how to make a great marinade. It's so simple. It takes just a few simple ingredients which you've probably already got in your, in your kitchen or in your garden. It starts off with some garlic, and we're gonna whiz that up. Okay, we've got the garlic. Then we're gonna put in some black pepper. I love using fresh ground black pepper. It takes about a tablespoon. And a little bit more. Okay, some rosemary, some olive oil, and red wine. A little bit more, why not? Okay, and I'm gonna just scrape down the sides. That's it. It's so easy. Oh, oh my god, it smells good. Okay, so I'm gonna take my chicken, oh, and a silver in a bowl, and I'm gonna put my chicken in a bowl. And I'm going to put in about half of this. And I'm just gonna stir it up just to get the chicken coated. The red wine, the black pepper, the garlic, it all acts as a meat tenderizer. So it's gonna soften and it's gonna make your meat that much juicier when you're cooking it. It's not gonna let it dry out like that hard, crispy stuff that gets so overcooked. Okay, so now that that's done, I'm gonna put it back in my bowl. Let's see if I can do this. Mm. Oh my goodness, that smells good. And I'm gonna pour the rest on top. When you get a red wine, don't buy a cooking red wine. Buy a good bottle of red wine that you would like to drink. Doesn't really matter if it's Shiraz, Cab Sauve, or, or Pinot Grigio, or, or anything like that, P Pinot Noir. You can, as long as you like to drink it and it's, it's readily available, go for it because the cooking wines are so salty and you don't want to add that extra sodium to your chicken or your meat. So I'm going to marinate this. Sorry, I keep my hands on my wine. Uh, I'm going to marinate this for well, a few hours and then I'm going to put it in the oven and I'm going to show you the finished result. See you soon. Oh, look at that marinade for meat. It just, it looks scrumptious and the red wine has added a nice little tinge of red to it. Let me give it a try. I mean, I'm trying the, the, the very end of it, which is normally the driest part, and it's not dry. It's so flavorful and moist. Mmm. Thanks for watching. I look forward to reading all of your comments.